for many Americans, this is Russia, majestic monuments in the Kremlin, the fortress of Moscow. For others, this is Russia, a Dr. Zhivago land with tiny bungalows snuggling under a blanket of snow. Or this, the changing of the guard at the tomb of Lenin. So you can imagine our surprise when we experience the new Russia. <laughs> These dancers perform before a national sports tournament, proof positive that Uncle Sam has a growing influence on Mother Russia. Even Arnold has made his way to Moscow. His movie, The Terminator, is showing at Moscow's biggest theater. All across the city, you can see signs that American culture is creeping in. If you think you deserve a break from borscht and cabbage, you can stop by the world's biggest McDonald's at Pushkin Square. It's one of Moscow's most expensive restaurants. Socialites eat here after visiting the theater or opera. America's biggest selling soft drink is starting to pop into the Moscow market, but it's 20 years behind the other popular American cola. Pepsi and Diet Pepsi control the cola market in Russia and all the former Soviet republics. We ran into a Pepsi vice president at a Moscow restaurant. He told us Russia is ripe with investment opportunities. Uh, we're very excited about the market. We feel that uh, the time is now to take even uh, a bigger stake in this market. Pizza Hut has opened a joint venture restaurant with Moscow investors. Russians line up for hours for a taste of American pizza under a sign written with the Russian alphabet. So for now, it looks as if the old hammer and sickle are gone from Russia. But the new hammer could be around for a long time. <laughs>